Hello, this is Dr. Gay from First Lick MRI, and this is an example of a discoid lateral meniscus. And a discoid lateral meniscus is just a normal anatomic variant where the meniscus is too large. It looks like a disc rather than a little triangular meniscus. And patients who have a discoid meniscus are more likely to get degeneration or wear and tear of the meniscus or just have a horizontal tear within the meniscus. Most often, though, we see it just incidentally. We see it, and the patients are doing fine. In this patient, they have a discoid lateral meniscus over here, and the medial meniscus actually has a tear. So I'm going to show you a normal medial meniscus and show you what the lateral meniscus, which is abnormal, looks like. So this is the medial meniscus. This round thing here is the femoral condyle, the femur. This big bone appears a femur. Down below, we see the tibia. And the tibia has a flat surface here along the lateral, I'm sorry, the medial side, and also a flat surface here, lateral side. And the femur is rounded. And the meniscus is a little fibrocartilaginous black wedge. It fits right in here between the round femur and the flat tibia. And this is a normal appearance of the, what we call the meniscus body. Should be a nice, beautiful triangle, very smooth, pointy inner margin. It looks like a little triangle here. Now the lateral meniscus should look just like this, but instead it is this broad disc appearing meniscus. It looks like a big broad disc. And the inner margin, instead of being pointy, is uh, just as thick as the outer side. So it's abnormally thick and again abnormally broad. Now if we look on another projection, this is a side view, this is the medial meniscus that looks normal in morphology. This is the front of it, looks like a nice triangle. Here's the back of it. And remember the femur is rounded. This is the rounded medial femoral condyle, the flat tibial plateau. And you can see the meniscus is fitting right in, in between there into that space. Again, it's the back of it and the front of it. Now if we go to the lateral meniscus, with the discoid configuration, we see the meniscus here. We go towards the middle a little bit and we see it just as big. It never comes down to that pointy part. And we go one more cut. This is the very inner side, so it never has a pointed inner margin, just a big, broad, disc-like meniscus. So again, this is called a discoid lateral meniscus. Thank you very much.